Hi guys, welcome to CA Inter Financial Management MCQs. We are doing a chapter of cost of capital. Request you all to join our Telegram channel for all the updates for costing FM and for CA Final SMP. So let's do the MCQ for today. So the question is, firm's cost of capital is the average cost of. Okay, this should be easy one, I guess. All sources of finance. B, all the borrowings, that is debt. C, all share capital, okay, and D, all bonds and debentures. This is too easy. Even if you have covered first lecture of cost of capital, you should be able to answer this. I hope that you will have commented below. So, of course, in this case, your KO is nothing but weighted average cost of capital or simply cost of capital or composite cost of capital or overall cost of capital is a weighted average of all the long term sources of finance. Long term sources of finance means equity, preference, debt and reserves and surplus. And debt will include public deposits, debt will include say the debentures, bonds, up and so on. Okay, any long term loans that you will have taken, that's it. So, in fact, I think A, B, C, D, there should have been one other option or option A should have been refined further. And that was uh, all long term sources of finance. You all will understand short term sources of finance. We all never ever try to be finding out their cost because it is short term. Our basic objective is that we should be able to calculate the minimum rate that we require in our business in long term so that all the expectations are met okay so therefore option a should have been all long-term sources of finance we will never ever try to be finding out the cost of creditors or cost of say uh, bank overdraft or something like this so out of the four options i guess answer whatever best we all can have should be a over here so a should be the correct answer i'll see you all next time bye take care